Happy Friday, everyone. Happy Friday. This is Mr. Arroyo again, and Miss McGinnis again, and today we will be, we will be bringing you the Miller Creek News again. So today's digital citizen tip of the weekend is turn your texts into phone calls. Make that personal connection. I'm going to call you. Sounds Don't good. forget the turn in date is next Tuesday for the pig races. Lots of prizes to be earned. I know you can do it. We've done a great job so far. Next week we'll be having our modified races, which the kids are doing a great job coming up with good ideas. And we'll be doing drawing for that in the part for the participants for that for $25 gift cards from Amazon. You love Amazon, right? Who doesn't? Now let's go to Isla for a news clip about the tech club. Isla? And today I'm going to be giving you a peek at the tech club. Uh, right now in Tech Club, we are working on code and programming. Uh, you can we use Code HS to explore different languages and types of coding. All of us are working on the Code HS uh, website. You can use a, a language, a beginning language like Carl, or uh, move on to JavaScript functions and uh, all other kinds of things. Another very interesting thing to learn on is HTML, which is probably what most people are working on. The best part of Tech Club? I'd probably have to say the community, all the people who you can talk to about whatever your project is and the freedom that you can get through working on these different projects. Thanks for watching. Now back to the studio. Hi, I'm Isla. Thank you, Isla. That was great. Lunch starting today will be Miss Gazaniga, and Speech and Debate is going to have a club photo taken next Monday at break in Mr. Brees' classroom. Don't forget to be there. You and Mr. Zella should probably be in there. You both like to talk a lot. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. We, we could uh, decide whether or not they're going to have a photo or not. There you go. Back to you, Ollie. All right. Well, homeroom results from yesterday. We had a beautiful day out there on the Miller Creek Playground. Foursquare, we had Biarigi and Tervet, who both got credit and showed up, and I think they had a good time. Good, excellent. Seventh grade penalty shots, Glossop scored eight, and Johansson won. Glossop brought her game. Nice effort by Glossop. Excellent. Today's games, weather permitting, I'm not a weatherman, but I'm going to say it's a possibility it's that they could be postponed. But in case the sun comes out, we do have 6th grade Foursquare, Hobbs versus Touchman. 7th grade Penalty Shots, Woods versus Cox. And in Badminton, we have Sylvia and Jillian versus Annabella and Stella. We have Sean and Danny versus Jordan and Rachel. We have Jeremy and Caden versus Reese and Zach. And we have Josh and Zach taking on Shoeless and Lundy. Fun fact about Shoeless is he's a pro tennis player. So my money's on Shoeless. Shoeless is a pretty good tennis player. He is. But we'll see how his badminton skills hold up. Mm -hmm. See you there. All right. Now we are going to have Elijah give us a little interview with Mr. Case. Guys, my name is Elijah Spitzer, and I'm going to do an interview on Mr. Case. So let's go. Case, how long have you uh, been working here? Uh, I've actually been working at Miller Creek for 18 years. I started in 1999 and uh, haven't stopped ever since. Uh, what is your favorite thing about teaching here at Miller Creek? I think for me, because I grew up in the neighborhood and I still live in the neighborhood, it's about making a difference in my community. It's not just a job. Um, it's about, quite literally, if I can improve the young people in my community, I know that that's going to come back to, to help everyone, uh, including myself, in the future. So like, why do you like to get so like involved in like all the activities here? Um, I think my biggest thing is just having every day be different. So if I'm involved in a lot of different things, um, then it it allows for my day to be different each and every day, and that makes it exciting. You know, over a I plan to be here at least thirty years. So, uh, have you ever thought about or wanted to teach another class besides tech? So for my first 15 years, I didn't teach tech here. I taught um, eighth grade history and English. I even sprinkled in one year of sixth grade history. Um, I would have to say, if I were gonna go teach something else besides what I'm doing right now, um, I think it would be uh, going back to US history. It's definitely a, a passion of mine and something I find really interesting and fun to teach. Uh, that's been it, and this is an interview on Mr. Case, so back to you guys in the studio. Thanks, Elijah. 
Well, that's all for today. I'm Miss McGinnis. And, and I'm Mr. Arroyo. He is Mr. Arroyo all day long. Have an awesome weekend, Panthers. Thanks for being with us.